20,000, I will do this one first. 20,000, 307, Series 1, three box break. Because my game plan is to always get as many breaks done in a night. Yeah, you know what? At the end of the day, Pete, we, uh, it was a money more so on the shipping. Defense mechanism for the Coyotes of Gossip Spare. We had too many issues with people, uh, on a roll of Atkinson for the Flyers. Expecting it to go expedited, and you can't do that for anywhere near that price point, so. We've got a young gun, Owen Power. That would be a solid one to get graded, by the way, Owen Power. We've got a portrait for Tampa of Kucherov. Center of attention for Vegas of Eichel. Canvas for Seattle of McCann. Everything that we do on there, we try out, we evaluate, and then we get back to it. We got a young guns of Jack Quinn. Jack Quinn. The corner is chipped on it. Sorry, what, what chipping are we looking at here? What corner are you referring to? Bottom left. No, it's not chipped. Might be a bit softer, but it ain't chipped. But most of the young guns that year are, are very similar to that. Dazzlers for Vegas of Marchesso. And even if it was chipped, I absolutely would grade it. Young guns for Carolina LaFontaine. I feel like if I have a bad version of a card, hypothetically, it's easier to sell it when the buyer knows exactly what they're getting. Florida Panthers debut of Lundell. We got a French variant for the Winnipeg Jets of Hellebuck. We've got, oh, there we go. A suit variant, Mitch Marner. Debut date of Bunting for the Coyotes. Young Guns Checklist for the Wild of Rossi Boldy. Yeah, I, I just more so like to not deal with the hassle of people sending back. Young Guns, a canvas black and white variant, Shawl Grain for the Leafs. The amount of times that we've sold cards, well, obviously consignments for customers. Customer gets the card, they're not happy with the condition of the card, they want to ship it back or a partial refund. Braden point for Tampa. Canvas. Honestly, I just think it's easier to get it graded. Customer knows exactly what they're getting. Cole Chetka for the Canes, young guns. I don't even care if it's an 8 or an 8-5. Still way easier to move that way. Canvas for the Hawks of Debrinket. We got a retrospective of Tomasino for the Preds. Well, here's the honest truth, Snow. Honor roll of Shalgren for the Leafs. Is most people who are buying raw are expecting or hoping it to be a 9, 5, or 10 so they can make extra money. Ratcliffe, young guns for Philly. Unfortunately, when it's not that, they don't like that. I'm not saying it's right, but that's why they're doing it. Portraits for the Capitals of Ovechkin. Defense of Makar for the Avs. And a Hughes for the Devils canvas. We literally get emails all the time on eBay, questions on raw stuff. And the amount of times we were like, well, I, I'm going to pay the value of an 8.5 because if it comes a, you know, an 8.5, then I'm, I'm even. But I, and, you know, I've learned that people literally like message me like, I need to have upside on it. It's like, well, 
That's exactly how it is. It's wrong. You're taking your shot at it. The problem is, if they're not winning, they don't like it. And eBay's pretty, uh, pretty generous to the buyers nowadays. Are there dishonest people on this on eBay? Yeah, you know there is. Sadly, Miro Heiskanen portraits for Dallas. And good evening, Sir Jeff. How are you? We got a hundo P for the Vegas Golden Knights of Stone. You are shocked. We got a French variant of Carlson for the Caps. We got a Young Guns of Zahorna for Pittsburgh. And Jeff, by the way, UFC and Masterpieces. You want to hop out with those ones? <laughs> Garland Canvas for the Coyotes. That is your best avenue to increase it. We got a Electro of Comtois for the Ducks. I'm just going to throw that out there for you. Portrait of Marner for the Leafs. Young Guns of Joshua for the Blues. Yeah, we deal with a whole bunch of different stuff for eBay stuff, for shipping stuff. Debut dates gold of Byram for the Avs. Hundo P for the Wild of Parise. Uh, no, Cannon Post has definitely lost packages. Debut dates for the Devils of Nolan Foot. We have had that happen so much time. Sadly. Dazzlers for Buffalo. Lukanen. Young Guns for Tampa. Barry Boulay. Young Guns Swayman for Boston. Uh, honor roll of Debrinket for the Hawks. It, I, I can tell you with very much certainty. It is Canada Post definitely does lose packages. Young Guns of Shekhovich for the Sharks. San Jose. We actually have a package missing right now from UPS. And it's a fairly large package. So companies can definitely lose packages. Canvas of Tara Vinen for Carolina. Electro of Line A for the Jackets. Canvas for Vegas of Pacioretty. Young Guns for Buffalo, Bryson. Honor roll of Shesterkin for the Rangers. Debut of McMichael for the Caps. Young Guns Kupari for L.A. And nice finish. Young Guns clear cut Michaelis. For Vancouver. Michaelis. Vancouver. All right, 2021 Series 1. Yeah, I always feel bad on that. I don't deal with a lot of the shipping stuff, but I step in when I need to type thing. And I hate it because most people, when packages get lost, it's always they blame us. Thank God we have some good members that don't do it. That is a rarity though, but I always feel bad because it's always us that somehow look bad. Canvas of Cassian for the Oilers. Oh, sorry. Yeah, for the Oilers. Young Guns for the Sharks of True. We've got a Retro 
respective jersey. Jack Hughes for the Devils. Yeah, there's absolutely tons of dishonest people. And unfortunately, there are many, many times that the post office loses your stuff. Nice combination there. Young Guns of Ottinger for Dallas. I remember reading Van Dirk. There was one guy. Portrait for the Coyotes of, uh, of Kemper. That did something like 74 claims on eBay. Portrait for Dallas of Bishop. And eBay and PayPal kept siding with them. And there's a massive threat about this guy. And it's like, it just goes to show you how they don't really care. Debut dates for the Islanders of Bellows. We've got a retrospective of Samsonov for the Caps. There's always this fun stuff that goes on. Portraits of Konechny for Philly. Oh, there's definitely not Van Dirk. It blows my mind. Young Guns Canvas Velarde for LA. Speaking of fun things, did you guys see the, the CGC? The CGC 10s uh, that are uh, making some good headway now. Joe Hansen, Young Guns for Buffalo. Young Guns. This is a good box. Norris for Ottawa. There's a pretty big thing going on with CGC falsely grading a bunch of 10s. Hellebuck for the Jets. And their excuse, in my opinion, and I might be wrong in this, so if anyone actually knows, let me know if I'm just getting wrong information. Schmaltz for the Coyotes. So for those that don't know, what apparently happened is they issued out to some known uh, big reseller Worldwide of Marshawn for Boston. A slew of a whole bunch of 10s. Young Guns, Kravtsov for the Rangers. And then someone started noticing it and obviously raised a bit of a stink about that, saying that these cards don't even look like they're close to 10s. Predominant of Carlson for Washington. And then they basically looked, uh, looked into it, apparently, CGC. Young Guns Clear Cut Evans for Montreal. Per perfect super. I will uh, double check. I got a lot of emails. 39 emails right now. So I'm sure it'll be in there. We got a Zuccarello for Minnesota. I'll tell you guys the story when I'm done this. I got like five packs left. We've got a Young Guns for the Canes of Geeky. Uh, no, Jeff, that's a different one. Brian Rust for Pittsburgh, which I also don't really understand. If you're using technology, then the cards would be significantly worse off-graded. Worldwide of Hurdle for the Sharks. And we've got a French variant of Hannafin for Calgary. And finish off with a predominant of Bennington for the Blues.